Hello, hello, welcome back to more. Let's play Diablo 2 with your host, nosy, or nosily sounding guy. Yeah, I'm not 100% right now, but I'm going to do the best that I can. So anyway, we are in the Arcane Sanctuary and we have four ways we have to go. One path has the correct way, the other paths have, um, well, just nothing. Well, they have treasure at the end. So we're going to do all four of them. Not today, though. It's going to take a little bit to get through them. Probably take a couple days. Good thing about this path that I got, um, these teleport pads, well, my my archer can take care of them. All of them, uh... Ooh, that's a lot of guys. A lot of guys. Anyway, no new enemies, but... These uh, ghoul lords are upgraded versions of the vampires from Act 1. They can cast fireballs and firewalls as well. And they're rather annoying. So yeah, all I gotta do is just kind of stand here. Let her take care of the good stuff. <laughs> but that's no fun. Might be safe. But who cares about that? Arcane Sanctuary is actually a pretty good place. Um, you get a lot of people who like to level up in here online and do Arcane Sanctuary runs early on. A little bit. And we won't know if we're at the... Ooh, a gem shrine. Ooh, okay. So, I don't think I've run into one of these. A gem shrine, if you have a gem in your inventory, upgrades it. If you have more than one, it randomly upgrades one. Like if you have a ruby and a sapphire, it will upgrade randomly one of them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I have these three chipped rubies. So I'm going to make room in my inventory. Impossible. And why can't I use that? Well, first I'm going to upgrade it. Da, 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 Sweet, there we go. Now I think if I put it all this crap back in my cube, it won't try and upgrade any of those. So okay, let's not forget our Herodric staff. Cause that would be terrible. Hit the gym shrine, and we get a normal ruby. Which, if we put that in their helmet, we'll get 24 to life. So let's do that. Hooray! 24 to life. Ah, well, you know, it's a little something. Better than 10 to life. Well, that's a lot of specters. Yeah, these teleport pads, we don't really know which one it's going to take us to. So we just go. I was playing the original Contra today on the NES. Man, I'm so bad at that game. It's been so long since I played it. Played it. So let's see. I think if we go on this one, that'll take us back. Yeah, so we can kill these guys. Ooh, about ready to level up, too. Hooray! I'm having a wonderful time. Okay. Yeah, there's actually not very many bosses, though, in this place. Which, I guess, is kind of okay. Does it... Do they actually tell us what we're doing here? Find Horizon's journal. Okay. So they did tell us what we're trying to do. So, our attack rating's doing better again. Could use a couple more life, though. And dexterity. Dexterity we want to keep kind of high to maximize our block value. I can feel a sneeze coming on. So if you hear me making noises off on the, the side, it's me trying not to sneeze. <laughs> Oop. Ah, I tried blocking it. Uh oh, our weapon's going to break. Much more does it got left? Nine out of... Well, it'll last. Last long enough at least. Oops, forgot my map. I do like this place, though. I like the background, the scenery, things like that. 
this is a place when you play online where the game would desync a lot, where you wouldn't be like synced up with the server, and you would have so many issues trying to uh, stay synced up because you would run forward and just hit this huge black wall and you couldn't go forward because the server you weren't recognized for where you were with the server. So I think we've gone this one. Nope, oh, nope, nope, not that one. You know, I can just jump across, but then my mercenary won't be with me. There we go. Alright, so, we've actually, I can tell by looking where we're at, we've reached, um, either where we'll find out where, if this is the correct one or the wrong one. And it's the wrong one. I can already tell. You can tell because there's all this gold on the ground. And there's a lightning spire up there. Plus all these treasure chests. You kill that. Let me pick up all this gold first because we're going to get a lot of items to drop out. Oh, okay. Haha, see? Lots of items. But nothing any good. So, alright, let's clear our way back. Okay, so this one? Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, I have to save my skill point too. Yeah, see, look at how much damage basically I'm not... Okay, so that fireball, see if I can get them to cast a firewall on me. Come on, cast a firewall. Okay, so I'm at 172 life. So see, standing in that, with that magic damage reduction, I didn't even take any damage. That's, um, really cool. But it doesn't really help against, like, high-impact spells like Fireball. Like their Fireball spell. You know. So if it's going to do 40 damage, well, now it's only going to do 38. Well, you know, big deal. But since I have that magic damage reduced by 2 ring, you know, the Firewall that might be doing 3 damage a second is now not it's doing 1. 8% extra gold for monsters. I'm just going to chuck that. I don't care about that. And we're almost back. Heal there. Ha! <laughs> Didn't teleport in time. Yeah, these... Unfortunately, these guys are still annoying. Are you gonna come around here? Well, I tried to kill him. Well, it looks like we made it back. Alright, well that's one wing clear, and next time we were going to head through, we'll try and get through two of the wings, hopefully I'll be feeling a little bit better. So I want to thank you for viewing, and I will catch you next time.